Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today we're actually going to be spilling some tea about books that, um, I do not understand the hype, and books that I kind of don't like. And this is basically my, my thought process is, this is books that BookTube made me think I was going to like because other people liked them, and once I read them, I realized I don't like them. So, um... We're gonna get started. So, the first book y'all are probably gonna hate me for because it's very well known. Everybody loves it. It's um, a series that this author is very like very popular. <laughs> Let me just say that one of her books is actually gonna become a TV series or something. Um, but I did not get the hype about this book series. So. <laughs> Yeah, I was just really confused. Her other book series, the one that's being adapted, I actually really like. So, um, just really so you don't have to like everything about your favorite author's books. So, <laughs> um, but that book is the Throne of Glass series by Sarah J. Maas. So, now, as I'm an adult, as I'm coming to terms with books that I love and I don't love, I just harbor very mixed feelings about this series because the first three books... Not even the first three books. The first two books I thought, you know, oh, it's going to be about this assassin who's, like, you know, powerful and, you know, maybe gets magic along the way. I didn't think it was going to be about magic fairies. I didn't think it was going to be about, like, huge-ass wars and go on for seven books. I thought it was going to be five books, six books max. <laughs> nope. Um, yeah, I didn't really get the hype about this one. Everyone and their mother loves it, and... I just harbor very, 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 very mixed feelings about it just because it's not it's not what I thought it was going to be within the first two books. So um, this is one of the books that I'm probably going to um, get hated for, but <laughs> it is what it is, people. It is what it is. The next series is one that's not as well talked about anymore than it was a couple of years ago, um, but that is the Legend series by Marie Lu. Um, I went into this series because I saw a lot of people actually really loved this series, so I read the first, well, I read all of them, but um, it took me a while to get through the third one because I just, I lost interest. I didn't know where the hell the story was going anymore. I still don't remember what this book's about, so that's kind of, um, that, that's kind of proof right there that this book series didn't really stick with me really well. So it's book, it's a series that I liked in the moment. But I don't really remember what it's about anymore, and I just don't have uh, good feelings about it anymore. Not because, you know, I don't like the writing or anything. It's just because I just don't remember anything about it. So it's not good feelings, and it's not bad feelings. It's just neutral feelings. I'm Switzerland about this book. The next series y'all are still going to hate me for, because it's going to be a, mo a, a Netflix adaptation. I mean, I'm going to watch the the adaptation. I'm gonna probably reread the books because of this, but um, I still don't get the hype about this fucking series. And like, I don't know if it's just me, but this whole series bores me. Um, same as Throne of Glass, it bores me. And um, I don't, I don't, I didn't, I didn't like it. Um, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry to you hardcore Shadow and Bow fans, but like, this series fucking bored me. I did not get it. And I didn't get the hype about the Dark One. I didn't get the hype about Malachi, whatever the fuck his name is. Again, I don't know. But, <laughs> um, I, am I gonna reread it? Because Shadow and Bone Netflix series? Hell yeah. Um, I'm not gonna get rid of these books, like, because I hate them. It's just, or I don't even hate them. I just don't get the hype. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm gonna try and reread them. Just maybe so I can understand somewhat of the hype, but, um, it was just really boring. <laughs> and, like, I read these in college. So, as a college student, they were boring. Yet saying something, you know? You know? You know? I'm gonna talk about these next two kind of in conjunction to one another, sort of. So, the first one is the Illuminate series by Jake Kristoff and Amy Kaufman. I just... D this, this book series had some hype. And I didn't like it. I mean, did I cry during Obsidio? Yes, I did. We're not gonna talk about that. <laughs> Um, just because, like, the way it was told was so hard to follow, so hard to understand, I didn't know what the hell was going on. And then, like, the second book, they switched characters to, like, two different different characters, so I was really confused. But, um, 
I mean, if it's your cup of tea, it's your cup of tea. But, like, for me, I just was, like, really confused. And I didn't quite understand what was going on. Uh, I know a lot of people are going to be like, why do you hate this series? I don't hate it. It's just so confusing. A lot of these books were just either boring or confusing. The next book, I just don't think I didn't like. Just because it wasn't for me. Um, that is Nevernight by Jay Kristoff. I just didn't even bother to read the, the rest of the series just because... Again, boring. I didn't like Mia. I didn't like the writing style. I didn't like anything about it, really. Um, and I didn't feel like I wanted to continue on with the series. Plus, if you know anything about what's going on with Jake Kristoff right now and what his new book's going to be about, like, I don't know. I'm going to let you do your research on that one because even I fully don't understand. But um, there's a lot of stuff surrounding Jake Kristoff right now that um, even then I didn't really like him before and I, didn't re I don't really like him now. So... Um, take that as you will. I'll talk about this one next because the last one's definitely going to get me some hate. <laughs> um, so the next, the second to last book that I just didn't really get the hype about and I didn't really like the series was the Red Queen series by Victoria Aveyard. Don't let, get me wrong, I love Victoria Aveyard as a human, but I didn't get this series and I don't know, I, it wasn't rememberable for me because I finished War Storm last month and literally I did not remember anything. So that's telling you something that like, these books aren't memorable, to me at least, um, because I don't remember anything about the plot. I didn't remember any of the plot what happened in this book. So this, this series just kind of was like meh for me just because I just didn't get it. Like the last, the first book was fine. Three books, the next three books were just, I, I couldn't tell you what went on in the last three books of this series because it was that boring. All right, and the last one, it's gonna get me some hate. But I'm still going to try to work my way through this series, um, is the Darker Shade of Magic series. Don't kill me. Um, I, when I read Darker Shade of Magic, I just didn't get it. And then A Gathering of Shadows didn't get much better. And Conjuring of Light, from what I can tell from the first, I want to say like 20 pages, is still not getting me, getting me like into the story still. And, like, I don't remember what's going on. All I remember is Lila Barr, the badass bitch. That's all I care. Um, that's all I cared about. Um, but I just, with this series, it's just something that, like, I have to absolutely love it. And with some of these series that I've talked about today, I just didn't love it. And that's saying a lot. So these were a bunch of the books that BookTube basically told me to read. And I just didn't like. Or I didn't care about them as much as like I should have. If you're still sticking with me through this video, thank you. Um, share your opinions on these books down below um, and share your opinions on other books that you may have a dislike with or um, a hate love relationship with or whatever. Um, I want to hear your opinions. I want to hear everybody talk in the comments. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon in another video.